All right. Well, yesterday I went and uh, started gluing these together. I got the epoxy all put together. As you can see, it uh, it comes up. It uh, holds amazingly strong because I had it outside on on the deck on that uh, deck thing. And I'm watching TV and just letting it dry. It's got a four-hour cure time. And uh, about two hours into it, some kids, freaking kids in my yard, man, come running through and knock the whole thing over, but it didn't do a thing to it. But, you know, it's working pretty good. I uh, got this one in. So now I have to glue the, the, the base, which is in the other room, to this thing. So that'll be good. I wanted to show you was... Uh, using a polymer and the uh, it's a two-part epoxy but really what it is is in a polymer and the uh, oxidizing agent is the uh, polymerase and what it does is uh, polymerizes the whole thing together but it doesn't bond to glass so I was just able to get this thing out of my beaker as you can see the beaker is nice and clean pretty amazing actually considering how nasty this stuff is and uh, what came out was like an almost perfect mold of uh, the beaker base. So pretty cool. The only thing I can't get out is the... Oh, uh, you can't see it. Anyway, you can see the water in there. It's not supposed to be staying in there. That's because uh, there's a whole bunch of polymer, uh, polymerized epoxy in the bottom of this thing. And I can't get it out. My fingers aren't going to do it. And then this thing, it's got so much freaking epoxy bonded to it, I'm just going to let it die. Anyway, in a minute, hopefully I'll be all set and be able to show you some gluing. I don't know how I'm going to do that because I kind of need two hands, but give it a shot. See you in a minute. 